Does this remind you of anything? Well, let me rejog your memory. Back when I was a young spud, every Saturday night I'd watch a show called Take Me Out with My Mum. The idea is there's an abundance of single girls with buzzers. A single man comes out, and over the course of a few rounds of seeing the guy's physical appearance, learning about him, at any point the girls can click the buzzer. And that just means they're not interested in the guy. By the end of all the rounds, there should just be one girl left and those two go on a date. Now, as I'm the best wingman in the world, I've got nine gym girls and three of my good mates who go to the gym. Hopefully today, I can find the loves of their life. All right, ladies, meet contestant number one, Callum. <laughs> Callum, nice to meet you. Soft hands, there we go. <laughs> Callum, nice to meet you. All right, Callum, relax, bro. Relax, come back. Oh, can come I not? Back. Oh, come back. All right, ladies. <laughs> if you like the look of Callum, don't click your buzzer. Ooh. If you don't like the look of him, who's <sighs> clicking? Click the buzzer. Oh! oh. <laughs> Free! Broke my heart. <laughs> Rosie, why did, uh, why did you stay in for Callum? Yeah, I like your fashion sense. I like the cargo. Thank it's you. like a cool guy, you know? Thank you. It looks nice. So the six girls remaining, and we're now brought on to round two. We've got a little video of Callum. Uh, one of his best mates has made a little video kind of explaining who Callum is a little bit, so we'll chuck that on. Yeah, so for round two, one of the contestants' best mates gives the girls a little insight to his life. At any point, the girls can buzz. The day Callum gets a girlfriend, we're we'll popping a bottle of champagne. Uh, I can't wait for that day to happen. So there's three things about Callum. He loves the gym, he loves money, and he loves girls. If you meet Callum at any point, he's doing one of these three things. And when he goes out, he always gives us a talk of, oh no, I'm not gonna pull girls today. I'm only focused on money. And then you see him chatting away, talking to one girl or another. And I will say, he has got some very smooth game. He is a bit of a riz god, so, you know, I'll give him that. But on a real note, Callum is a really good lad. If I had a female friend, I would recommend him to them and uh yeah so this just could be your guy uh, oh ah, shit. <laughs> how do you feel about that i was expecting it to be fair well <laughs> i think it was the, the talking to the girls yeah but you needed to take me out of the game that's what i need do you know what i mean i won't be doing none of that do you, are you not a fan of a player then no i'm not into a player at all <laughs> do you not mind a player then do you think you can change callum I don't necessarily think it's playing if you're just going and talking to girls. I think it shows confidence. I wouldn't mind if he came and approached me in public, so. Round of applause for her. Can I just say that? Round of applause. What about you? You don't mind a player? Oh, I feel like if you started speaking to me, you won't want to speak to other girls anyway. Ooh, that's confidence. Confident, I like, I like that. that. Yeah. I like that a lot. We're now left with only three girls, and we're brought onto round three. For round three, we have got special talent. Not much explaining needed for this. The guy shows off a special talent. If the girls like what they see, they stay. If they don't, they buzz. Does anyone like magicians? Who wants me to do the magic trick on them? That was quick. I like that. There we go. But how it works is, yeah, if I get it right, I get a kiss on the cheek. Is that a deal? Yeah. There we go. Cool. Pick a card, any card, whatever card you want to pick. Don't show me. Don't show me. All right, cool. Right, so I'm going to tell you what the card is. Good eye contact as well, to be fair. You're getting a bit nervous. No. No? I like that. I reckon it's Queen of Hearts. No. Shit. <laughs> All right, but we can still do that. I win. There we go. <laughs> Game over. Amazing. See you later. <laughs> Thank you. We're now brought on to the final round. There's only two girls left, and for once, the power's now in Callum's hands. We will ask one question. Based off their answer and his attraction to the girls, he will go and buzz one of them. The girl standing is the winner. I have a question. When you have a chewing gum in, do you spit or swallow the chewing gum? Spit it. You spit it? Sorry. Do, do I go with my voter now? You go. Oh, see, this is a hard one though. Oh, this is hard. I rate the answer though. <laughs> and it's the blue and the blue. <sighs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's all right. I love the kiss though. Thank you. You're fine. Nice kiss. <laughs> 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 no, give a round of applause. How you doing? Okay, you good? Okay, yeah. I'm good, thank you. Oh, come here, come here. Oh, Jay, are you happy with? Yeah. Yeah? Whoa, there we go. I'm a happy man. See you later. Peace. I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm gone. One down, very successful. Now, it was time for my boy Ty. My name is Tymon King, 25. I'm from Birmingham. 
Amelia, why didn't you buzz? Um, he just seems like nice vibe, pretty chill. Yeah. Yeah. T, second buzz, first round. <laughs> Look really picky, don't I? Maybe it was the trip, but... <laughs> Three girls decided to buzz out, which left Ty with five girls for round two. Okay, round two. We've got a trailer from his cousin. Tyron, there's a positive and negative about Tyron, yeah? Tyron is very obsessive when it comes to the gym, which means he ain't really gonna be spending much time with you. Also, he doesn't like if someone asked him to go out, he wouldn't spend no money because he got food in the freezer. <laughs> So I'm telling you, yeah, you will just not be taking you out many times, but you'll treat you, right? You know what I mean? He goes to gym, so he's got a sick body as well. You get me? I was just about to clap you because I thought no one had buzzed. <laughs> You have just spoke about how he had quite a nice vibe and stuff. <laughs> what, uh, what changed your mind? Um, that you're always in the gym and you don't like going out on dates. I mean, I need someone that's going to take me out on dates and spend you know, time with me. He over-exaggerated that one bit. So. <laughs> I'm not even going to lie. Is it, know, is, really it, is, it, is, it, is it the same answer for you? Uh, same yeah. thing. I mean, gym dates are fun, but you need to go out and have fun as well. Yeah. Need a bit more personality than just a gym time. I know, man. <laughs> Sometimes an obsession with the gym is not great for getting women. Now, we're brought to round three. We have three girls remaining. We're on to round three. And this round is special talents. Um, what have you got for us, mate? So, ladies, I'm actually a qualified poet. Okay, cool. G? G, yeah. G. I'm kind of into you, you know. I'm kind of into you. I want to win your heart like Seabom did Olympia. <laughs> yeah. Not really that one? No. Nah. Hunter, why, uh, why the buzzer? Do you know what it is? He's got good energy, he's got a good smile. However, yeah, you just come more forward with it. You're good. You've yeah. got confidence, you do poetry. Come on, it's better than bars. I hear that, I hear that. You ain't coming with that energy. Uh, what about you guys? I just expected more. To more. Honest. I love the poetry, but. So unfortunately, my boy Ty did not find the love of his life today. However, look at his fucking arms. They're wham. It was now time for my final mate, Hal, to potentially find love. <laughs> this is Hal. You right, guys? So I'm Hal, I'm 21, and I'm from Nottingham. Okay. Oh! 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 <laughs> no, I did expect that, I did expect that. Fair play, Mine. fair fucking play. Everyone stayed in. T, you've, um, you've gone out for everyone in the first round, apart from this, why are you all? The white vest joggers combo. Yes. Thank you very much. Okay. Oh, everyone's in for you still. Mm. However, the trailer has been getting quite a lot of red buzzers this video. Uh, yes. So, let's see how's trailer, guys. Yeah. I don't actually think I actually met anyone more obsessed with himself than how. Where to even start? The man's got three addictions. The gym, looking himself in the mirror and pouting. He'll see a mirror and he'll do one thing. And one more thing, he's addicted to tanning. But apart from that, girls, if he's not pouting on his phone, he'll treat you well. G, why pouting, did you both? Pouting, pouting. I can't help, I do it subconsciously, <laughs> I swear. Oh, I just can't bad, help yeah, me do it. Bad. Is yeah. that a nick? That, yeah, that is a nick. The pouting not give you a nick? Not too bad, we've all got bad habits, but <laughs> I could just, yeah, I could change some of mine. Oh, oh. Hunter. <laughs> no, so I'm so sorry, but no, it's just, yeah. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's fine. What, what, because you stayed in the first round, but what was no, it? I've been optimistic. Okay. <laughs> well, there was just a few things that I saw that I was like, okay, no, no, I'm sorry. No, it's fair enough, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was optimistic. I was left with still five girls, brought on to round number three. What, what is your talent for these beautiful women? So basically, about 10 years ago, I used to be a gymnast and I think I can still do a handstand for like a long time. So I'm just going to try and handstand for as long as possible. <laughs> <laughs> Can't get much worse with the poetry. I'm no offense, Ty. <laughs> Deep breath. Ooh. Hey. Don't break this studio. <laughs> There you go.
Everyone stayed in. <laughs> oh yeah, buzz. Fair play. But I've, <laughs> but I've got a different colour. Now we're brought on to a round which the other two contestants didn't actually get to. You see, there's still five girls remaining. So for round number 3.5, let's say, Hal has to buzz three girls out and leave it to just two left. Uh, God, this is horrible. <laughs> oh, I feel really bad. Uh, this is so weird. Uh, uh, sorry. Okay. Uh, oh, this is really difficult. This feels so weird. Sorry. Uh, one left. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> oh. It was now down to the final two girls. Final round, two girls left. Yeah. You've got the choice here. You want to ask these two girls one question. Yeah. And based off the answer, based off how attractive you find them, you're going to eliminate one and then there'll be one left. So my question is, if we were to go on a date that has nothing to do, to do with the gym, what would we do and why? Um, I would do go-karting because I'm super competitive nice. and I'm a bit of a thrill seeker as well. Awesome, good answer. Oh, okay, so I'm a gym girl, so obviously gym. Yeah. I think we would do something, like you said, something competitive, but something active too. I want to be able to see how strong you are and if you can keep up. He looks quite strong. It was now decision time. <sighs> Sorry. <laughs> Amelia. <Hello>. Sorry. <laughs> Woo! Nice, nice to meet you. you. How are you? Yeah, good, thank you. Good. Yeah, you're, you're, you're very beautiful. I think, we, I think we'd be perfect together. <laughs> well, who knows, these two could get married in the future. But one thing's for certain, I'm a bloody good wingman. Thank you guys for watching the video. Go follow all the people that were involved. Their links will be below. Cheers, guys.